Oh, the belt is burnt right off there. I went to Walmart and a few other stores and they didn't have this belt. So what I did was I glued it together with this glue. We're going to sew some dental floss through the rubber where the joint is. And then we're going to coat it with this uh, crazy glue. This is glue that comes from the dollar store. But it's similar to crazy glue. Is it easy to push through that rubber? No, do you need a number? Huh? No, it's not easy. Same here. That seems to be about good right there. We're using dental floss to uh, straight, strengthen up the uh, crazy glue. It's a little tough with the rubber to have to use the thimble to poke through. Yeah, it takes. Gee, that's close to your uh, thumb, isn't but it? But you have to. Yeah. So anyway, that's what it looks like. We'll be back. dry for a few minutes and then I'll go put it on the vacuum. And it right there. Okay, let's try it out. Because it is sticking up a bit. This little knot piece here is sticking up. So that's what's hitting there on the, uh, the plastic. Let's see. Let's see, go this way. Oh yeah, I can feel it right in there. Let's see if I can show you that. Bring the camera in here. Okay, you see right there, see the knot is hitting the plastic. Hmm. And I didn't want to put the knot on the inside either. I guess that's how it'll have to be. That's for a temporary fix. I wouldn't go more than a week or so and I wouldn't do a big haul with this vacuum but I would certainly, you know, a, a normal size house that's got a, some rug in the living room and bedrooms, yeah I would use it. Okay, that's it for now.